boys got a spicy reward video for your double upload we made over a million coins across our two accounts double elite one rewards some spicy pools in here the road to glory has more than tripled in value in a week good luck with your rewards hope yours went well let me know in the comments how yours did but here are my rewards and i've still got jumbo packs saved for tomorrow which i'll add to tomorrow's video thank you for watching boys have a great evening Zell boy army here we are we are opening our rewards those are the rivals ones we're on the xbox account at the moment any rivals rewards i'm getting i'm probably going to go for the packs might go for coins on the ps4 just for um to get as good a tier as possible but we'll be opening packs like the we got elite one on both consoles we're going to be opening the red picks and the team of the season packs today the team of the season packs aren't transferable so you have to open them now really anyway um, with Elite 1, you get two Jumbo Rare Players Packs. I'm going to be opening them at 6pm on Friday. Because right now, I think the Team of the Season is not as good. So I may as well save it for a better Team of the Season. Okay, lots of coins. Player Picks. Okay, let's see what we get. These Player Picks, there's not many on this team. Like, when we come to Premier League, La Liga, there's going to be some silly ones. The ones that I really like the look of, that I'd love to add to my team, would be Joe Gomez. Calvin Phillips, and it pretty much stops there on Xbox. Zaha, the weak foot may be too bad to have as an impact sub. Anderson might, I'd probably use Anderson as an impact sub, it'd be great. Um, I would like on the PS4 road to glory probably Moses Simon, even Godin would be pretty good. Um, there's a lot more on the PS4 that I'd use, but Joe Gomes and Calvin Phillips are the two we want on here. This is the type of crap that I'm expecting to get. Grimaldo, Leno, Lucas Leiva. They're okay cards, but yeah, Leno, who's going to use him? Lucas Leiva, pretty irrelevant. Um, Grimaldo's decent. That is a good card. Put an anchor on him, and he's one of the best left backs in the game. But he's worth like 40 to 50k. He's so cheap that it's like. I could just go buy him anyway. I'll probably get... I'll take Grado because I might even use him in my team. Um, yeah, I don't know why Leno's such a low rating. A bad start. Uh, tempted to go Ben, ben Rama as an impact sub. We've already got Grimaldo. Pepe is probably not good enough to get into the team. Uh, Pepe, if he had 10 more pace, would be a top centre-back. Dembele on the Xbox end is good an impact sub. Uh, Benton Core's not getting in the team, and he's so cheap. Yeah, ben Rama does link to a towel. I think Ben Rama's more just an impact sub, though, on this team. Go, Ben Rama. Pretty awful so far, though. Like, those are two players I didn't even mention. Like I just don't care for them on this team. Okay, can't get much better than... I can't get much worse even. Okay, that's better. That's a lot better. That That's a lot better, because Mukiele is actually a top centre-back. Brandt is pretty good. It's it's an obvious choice between Courtois, Mukiele and Brandt, I would say. I'm probably going to go Mukiele. Like, Mukiele... He's probably somewhere around top 10 centre-back in the game right now. He'll go down the pecking order with all the team of seasons to come, but he's rapid, he's very good on the ball, his defending stats are very good, and he's got very good physicals. What do you guys... Anyone who's watching this as a video, I'm streaming these live, make sure you check out my Twitch, link in the description below. But anyone watching um, the stream, who do you think I should pick? Courtois would be nice for SBCs, and... Pretty decent, but I think Mukiele is the obvious pull here. I think Mukiele is very useful. French, easy to link in. I'm going to go Mukiele. I think Courtois would be nice, but I'd, I'm not going to use him when I've got a 92 to Stegen. He isn't going to save me a lot of coins on SBCs anyway. Mukiele is an actual potential start for the team. And being French, very useful. Um, I think those are pretty bad player picks. 
considering some of the players we could get, the Grimaldo is one of the better left backs in the game right now. But what exactly am I going to use Grimaldo for when I could just buy him for forty fifty k anyway? Ben Rama, hard to link in. Mukiele, I'm pretty happy with him. Mukiele's saved that from being some of the worst picks you'll see. Okay, of course, EA just saving the look. We're getting Calvin Phillips and Gomez in the, our team of the season pack now. Let's have a look, okay. It's community, so it's got to be a walkout. I got that Palmer from my... Uh, we want English as the board. Oh, you can't get Calvin Phillips from this, can you? Fernandinho? Lucas Leiva? Casemiro, he's a 92. I mean... That means it can't be Jordan Go Jordan, Joe Gomez, I think. Casemiro's not a bad pull. He's worth a, a fair bit. It leaves the option of some decent players. Zaha's available. Philippe Anderson, maybe. Joe Gomez. Joe Gomez won't be in the pack. That's a bit of a rip. Um, who else is there? Uh, Simon's pretty good. Mukiele. We're probably going to get two 30, 40k players though behind this, but. <laughs> yeah, there you go. Dembele's worth a little bit. 70k, but. That's pretty poor. I'm just going to go on to Footwiz to sell them straight away, because none of these dossers are getting in the Xbox team. Casemiro is 195k. Thing is, like. This is still this pack alone is nearly worth as much as most of the top hundred eleven packs you get from Team of the Weeks. Musa Dembele. Seventy K. It's not bad. They are dossers, that's the thing. They're not going to get in this team, so... Bentoncourt, I actually think, looks decent. I actually think he looks good value. Four-star, four-star. Decent pace, good physicals, decent on the ball, solid all round. I actually quite like that card. He just can't shoot. He's basically... This 88 Bentoncourt, in my opinion, is basically a better Frankie de Jong, bar his team of the year. Okay. That pack was worth 210k. So, so far, we've made 330k. Still got two jumbos. We've still got um, this pack, and then we've got the player picks, obviously. Okay. I mean, if Casemiro is the best we get, though, that is pretty rough. <laughs> this is... This is even more why I expect to see that Dosser walking out. Now, mate, why are you do? Why are you turning around and going like that, pointing at your name? I don't want to see Galaxy coming out. I don't want to see that. He's just trying to wind me up there. Why do I want to see that Dosser come out of the pack and be pointing at his shirt name like I don't want that? That's disgusting, man. Oh, it's actually a good pack. We got the one good one that could be under that rating. Okay, he ain't a dosser. We'll take that. There we go. We've already made more than I've made from any top 100 finish all FIFA. Galaxy was just trolling us because he knew what was weighing. Moses, what a man. We already used Moses in the team. Galaxy, see you later. Lucas Laver. Is it is Lucas Laver even a good card? He looks well though. Ingram with the gifted sub, my man. I appreciate. Ingram, mod of the channel, said he would gift a sub if we pack something good. And I'd agree. That was a good pack. I appreciate that a lot, Liam. Lucas Laver, is he even a decent card? I actually think for a cheap team like my PS4 Road to Glory, there is a potential that I could get this card in the team. If he got as a player pick, he's usable. 
and easy to link in. Just a bit slow. Uh, but not worth anything, so. Okay, 30 grand. How much is Moses worth? 185. Pretty decent. Moses saved this from being a pretty dreadful set. Okay, we will go over now to the PS4. But how much how much did we make from that? Let's have a look. So we still got two jumbos. That's probably 25k of discards. 94. I thought I'd put him for 99. Uh, 120. 160. 190. 260. Roughly 450. 125k. We're going to make like minimum 600k. That's pretty decent. That's a lot better than what I'm used to on this. Okay, let's move to PS4. Boys, here we are. On the PS4 Road to Glory, these rewards matter a lot more to me, to be honest, than the um, Xbox One because this is the team that could be changed drastically. Let's have a look. Okay, we're probably going to go coins on here. Yeah, coins. 58k coins, way better. We're in Div 1 now on this account, but if we'd have had two ultimate packs, might have gone for that, but yeah. 58k coins is pretty useful on this account. Okay. So we're at 163k before Elite 1. 163k. Let me write that down and we'll see what we end up on afterwards. Most picks here. We've got Elite 1 again on here. Most picks here could make a big difference to the team. Okay. I, I just want a top player pick. Gomez or Phillips would be a game changer for this account. Uh, I'm not going to go Leno. Don't really want either of these. Pepe is good, but I don't think I have the means to link him in on this account. It's probably going to have to be Benton Corn. I just hope. I just hope that I get some good pulls elsewhere. Benton Corn, we could link in at some point. Jay is the best player, but I'm not going to be able to link him in. That is a shocking start, though. I appreciate the sub, Mel. Appreciate the sub a lot, my man. Thank you very much. Welcome to the Zellboy sub family. Courtois PK. It's probably going to be. It's probably going to be PK on this team. Pretty awful rewards again. But, um, yeah, probably PK. I think we say PK. Courtois, I've already got to stay again. Yeah, PK is. I'm pretty disappointed so far, though. Like, Ben and Coy, yeah, we could link to Godin. It would be good, but PK's alright. Uh, I guess Golden links to the Benton core. We already use Musa, but Golden's worth more. Probably going to go Golden. I'm probably going to sell Dembele and not use him anyway, though, Liam. I'm probably not going to use Dembele anymore, because I want a better weak foot on my attack. If we go Golden, then we can have Golden and PK as our centre backs. That is a pretty decent pair, and they're a little bit slow, but at this point of the game, plus it means I could, I've got a higher rating for SBCs if I don't like Golden long term. So there's a chance we might get a better centre back who's a bit quicker for our team. I wish I'd have got Mukiele on this account. Well, on this account, Mukiele would have been really good. I'm going to go Golden just for the 93. Pretty disappointed. I think those are not the best, considering they're not that expensive. But 
Ben and Corn go into Link to Stegen, Samedo, that gives PK the full chemistry. Okay, we'll save these packs, the Jumbo ones, for tomorrow. Come on, just give me a good pull on here, man. Something that will allow me to massively upgrade the team. Grimaldo. Oh no, PK. PK is worth a bit. And PK means that there could be a few other good players in. Yeah, PK hopefully will be doing these dances. PK means there could be anything. I mean anything lying behind him. Could be a Gomez. Could be a Zaha. Could be absolutely nothing. That's what I'm expecting. Not bad. Not bad. Casemiro's worth a bit. Casemiro's worth a bit. We'll sell them now. PK, how much is he worth on PS? He's worth 200k. Jeez. Alright. Fantastic. That is a good pull on it. That's a good pack, that. Okay. That was a big pack for this team. I feel like the rewards have already been alright now because we've got two usable setup backs at least. Casemiro, 100k. Is he going for around that? Okay, and then Lucas Leiva. How much are you, mate? 36. When I saw Spanish, I swore I, could, I was getting Grimalda. Okay, that, that's a good one, that. We made like 350k. You, we've made nearly 500k before this pack and the two jumbo packs, so we should make like six to seven hundred k minimum. Please, yeah, please, Vancouver, Zaha, Gomez, Anderson, give me a Brazil flag, English flag, PK, please. Busquets, okay, I forgot. I was like, who's the CDM? Hmm. Could be anyone still. Could be anyone still. There's potential to use Busquets with a shadow. Even he'll still be slow, but it's the triple link to Pika. Could be anyone. Predictions in the chat. Who are we getting? Who are we getting? We just big pull, please, please. Busquets, work your magic. Probably going to be two basically discards. Brandt. I think that's pretty good. I think. I think he's worth over 100k. He's going to disappoint me. Right? 168k. Let's go. Big pull. I think we've done pretty well there. That pack's worth. We got Lucas Leva twice. Uh, 70, 230. How much did we make from the other pack? We'll see in a sec. Lucas Lave is like 36. At the end of the day, we've got 200 to 300k worth of centre backs. Plus maybe 6 to 700k from these with two jumbos left. Okay, Brandt. 170k or so. I'm going to keep Busquets just in case I potentially want to use him into a team that I build, but. Right now, I don't think we will use him, but we've got the potential sell. Boys, hope you enjoyed that. I will add the Jumbo Rare player packs to tomorrow's video. Thank you very much for watching. Have a good one.